what it is and what it ain't, y'all. Snapback Streets, back at y'all. <laughs> what it is y'all here I'm gonna show you guys on how to actually change up your brims if you want to go the whole way of taking the cloth and material off your brims and switching it out with either snake skin or any other type of materials I know the professor had did a video on how to um you know swap out the brims and um he did a video also on um you know how to put the snake skin on the on the brims but you know he didn't want to show the process because it's a long process to do but um, I'm gonna show you guys how it's done in a process in which I found it might be a little bit easier where you might where you don't have to use so much glue you could probably make it work with one glue stick maybe two the most or one and a half but um basically what I did was you know as you can see took out the whole material on the brim all you have is the plastic and I'm using this snake skin material right here I also have this other snake skin material or like I said you can use a cloth material too if you want to use some other type of materials but I'm, I'm gonna show you guys how it's done though basically what I'm doing is I started off by gluing the edges first around you know well first you know you're gonna cut out your shape of the brim but you're always gonna make it a little bit bigger because you gotta remember you're gonna you know flop this over to glue it so what I do is glue it up to right here first is you're gonna glue it all around the edges first I mean well first basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna you know like I told you in the first video you know trace it out you know the um the length of it a little bit bigger because you're gonna fold it around the edges and you're gonna glue it all around the edges so when you glue it around the edges what happens is that it leaves it nice and tight on there so what all you have to do is um stretch the brim and glue it in here where my fingers at around the edges and pull you know like you're gonna stretch it and squeeze down stretch and squeeze down so it stays glued and it's nice and you know real nice and flat and it will not look bumpy at all and this is what you're going to basically have looks very sick nice and clean professional look very easy process doesn't take that long you just have to be patient and then what you're going to do is um you know you're going to cut out the under the under part of the brim where it's basically going to fit into there and you're basically like going to seam it you know together so you know that's all basically and then you know you're gonna cut it right there so you know that part is gonna fold that's the part you're gonna glue to the crown of the hat and it'll look very dope what's going on y'all back at y'all real quick bring you an update um on a tutorial on how to put the snake skin on the brim as you know you can watch that in the earlier part of this video so um basically what I was doing with um leftover scraps was um trying to figure out you know what I can use it for or, you know put it somehow like cuz I'm not a big fan of you know like the belt backs you know that, that the just dawn hats actually have I don't really you know really like that so I was trying to figure out a new way of adding the snake skin to a snap so basically that's what I did here so I'm gonna show you guys what you're gonna do basically is um you know you're gonna take your snap or whatever whatever color you're gonna use and you're gonna go with a piece of paper and um basically put it over there and trace it over you know of where those engravings are at in the snap as you know there's engravings in the snap right there so you're gonna trace that outline and um, this is what you're gonna get, you know, and you cut that out because this is gonna be your your stencil for um, you know tracing on the actual material that you're gonna actually use. So as you see, it fits right in there perfectly. And you just take that, you know, put it on your your material that you're gonna use, trace it out, 
and you know cut that sucker out so basically what you have is this yes doesn't that look sick very very sick very very sick as you can see I did a different color combination here and y'all gonna see why later but um I just had to show you guys this showing you some creativity from snapback streets and I'm um, showing you guys how to do that basically you know so you guys can take that idea and just remember who showed you it <laughs> but yeah it's very easy like I say just you know trace that out and then glue it on top of the snap and on the other part or if you want you know you can do it where where you got one part of you know the, the snap with the snake skin and the other part without it so you can go ahead and like you know still have that original snapback look with the snake skin so you know you have something like that you put those like together or if you want to have them on both do it like that so hope this was helpful like i said subscribe peace holla back